Yeah, Greg, because this is only for students who are quarantining. Once they're done, they go back into the classroom. That's why district officials say this is viable. In a unanimous decision. Five eyes. Bartlett school board members voting to give a virtual learning option to students who have to quarantine. It means that they would be doing the work of the regular class. Of the regular class. They would be able to get graded for it and they would not have to be counted as absent. Some parents support the program. I am here in an attempt to keep my son safe and to keep their staff members, their peers, their teachers, and everyone in this community safe. Others frustrated with the quarantine policy. I can't do that. I cannot provide for my family if I have to watch my son for 14 days like that neither can my wife. We both work. We can't do this. It's insane. It's insanity to me. Tennessee lawmakers prohibited most forms of virtual learning earlier this year, but Bartlett district officials say this program is allowed because it's only for quarantining students who go back into the classroom once they're clear. Officials also say the program follows guidelines from the State Board of Education. This is not us around uh, the governor's order. It just is the state board has allowed this. Officials couldn't tell us how many students are currently in quarantine, but they say only 39 students of the district's roughly 8,500 have tested positive for COVID. If we are at a shutdown like a whole class, we could go synchronous, which means we could have the teachers zooming and working with those kids. Yeah, officials say the virtual option will be implemented immediately. Other area districts like Shelby County Schools are offering similar programs. Live in Bartlett, Andrew Ellison, WRG News, Channel 3.